their videos are so positive all the time. And yesterday, they posted a video. Good morning, guys. I'm starting off with the day hanging up clothes in Annabelle's closet because I just did her laundry. I'm tired. And I think I might be getting sick. But, like, not, like, sick, sick, like, <clears throat> probably just, like, a cold. But, this is what's happening right now. I'm so lazy with this stuff. It's so bad. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Where's the happy chickies? Where's the happy chickies? That's a happy baby! <laughs> Sit Alfonso, boop your nose. Got to go like this, go boop, 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 boop. Boop, 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 boop. Is that funny? Do you want him? Do you want him? Good num 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 num. Good num num num. Like this. Oh, namas. Namas. Okay, do you want to keep swinging? Okay, swing, and we got to wind. Wind it, wind it. Oh, no. Ooh. A struggle. Upside down. Those are juicy. Are you gonna spit up? Crazy Fabulous. Oh yeah. Went to bed at like 12.30 and woke up at almost 4. Yeah. 
geekies. What do you do today? What do you do at work? Um, build some stuff, loaded up a semi truck. Baba's grandma's breaking things. Are those Nami? Are you eating your fingers? I just changed her diaper. She pooped again. I'll change it again. I feel bad last time, like, normally I like hear her poop or notice that she has pooped. And so I'll change it, like, basically right away. And I didn't notice, so I have no idea how long. Was sitting in there it obviously wasn't very long like i changed her diaper probably like two two and a half hours ago but like <laughs> so bad i'm such a bad mom <laughs> i'm just kidding it'll be okay i just need to make sure to keep an eye on that because she goes like a couple days without pooping and then she'll get it all out in one day and i think today is that day that she just gets it all out but yeah all right so i filmed a little bit of a rant yesterday and it was pretty late and I was looking over it and it just didn't really make a lot of sense so I'm kind of gonna redo that whole rant right now but um I don't know if you guys watch the boss life videos um but they're this family um it's mom dad four kids um and they make videos all together as a family which is something you don't see that often especially with um, families with older kids but their videos are so positive all the time and yesterday they posted a video and Darcy um, was talking about how they have struggles just like everyone else and they have things that are hard on them and bother them and they bicker and fight and all these things all the things that everyone else does but they choose not to show it in their videos because they want to keep a positive vibe and i feel like so many people post videos and it's almost like they're trying to get attention for the bad things that are happening in their lives and i feel like i'm guilty of that as well and I don't I've come to realize that and I realized I don't want that to be what this is about I want to show everyone the happy parts of my life plus talk about the things that are hard but not actually show the situation itself so kind of what I'm trying to say and what Darcy was saying in their video is that staying positive inspires so many people and sh she went on to say that she doesn't know what kind of things like discourage you or thing like that but for her positive things inspire her and they're also talking about how they have these big dreams and they're basically risking their financial stability to act upon these dreams and hopefully get somewhere and i feel like i'm kind of doing the same and so it's really easy to relate to them in that case because i don't want a normal nine to five job obviously i'm going to college because if that's what it comes down to and that's what I have to do, that's what I'll do. But I also have a full tuition scholarship, so I'm not wasting my money on college. I have I have the knowledge, I have the brain to go to college. And I'm not saying that not everyone has that, but some people just don't have it in their heart to fulfill that. And some people don't think they need college, and that's fine. Not everybody does. But, like... I'm going to college because that's basically my backup plan. The degree that I get in college, like, I will use that as a backup plan. I will use that if I truly need to. But what I would love to do is stay home with my family and raise my daughter and maybe even homeschool. I don't know. But I want to spend time with my family and I want to do that constantly. And 
I want to do something outside of the box, whether it's YouTube or who knows what else, but I have all these things that I think up in my head. And I always tell myself, like, oh, well, you're probably never gonna get there, even though that's all I really, really want. And so it's, it's really hard to stay positive sometimes, especially in the situation that I'm in. I'm not in the state I wanna be in. I'm not in the situation I want to be in necessarily. I had a daughter when I was 19, which was something that was unexpected, but something I, like, I did it. So, I mean, it's not like I can hold it against her, and it's not like I would. I love her so, so much, but it just wasn't my plan. And so, when different things come up in life, like, you have to rearrange your plans to be able to work with those things. Like, Audra in the Boss family, she had a baby not too long ago she's not much older than I am and she's making it work and she's doing an amazing job so seeing people like that and seeing all their positivity even though they come out and tell you like hey we have these struggles we have these things that we worry about we're struggling financially and that's because we have these big dreams and we're gonna act on them like there's so many things in their videos that are just so positive and so re-encouraging and like, I'm just, they almost feel like family to me because I can relate to them so well. And watching their videos, I feel like makes me a better person because they have hard times. Everyone has hard times, but they choose to show the positive times. So if that gives you any inspiration to just be a more positive person, to believe in yourself, to kind of take risks once in a while, to get to where you want to be and if you're not getting that from me go watch their videos go get it from them because i see it every single day i watch all their videos and sometimes it's just because i need that extra little boost of confidence or positivity in my day and in my life so i hope you guys loved this video um i hope you all have a good day good night wherever you are whenever you're watching this and i hope you stick around for more and yeah, we post videos every day at around 5 o'clock, at least Monday through Friday. I'm not sure exactly on the day schedule, but time schedule 5 o'clock. And I hope you go back and watch videos from a few months ago when I had my beautiful baby. And how things have changed between now and then, or even watch the videos before I had her. Because it's... It's my life, and you might not like my life. You might not want to follow along with my life, but some people might. So if you do, go ahead and go back and watch those videos. Subscribe, like, all those fun things. And I want you to know that I love you all so much. And if you need any extra bit of positivity in your life, I hope that I can give that to you. And if I can't, the boss family can. So go watch their video. Subscribe, like.